This is actually pretty legit. This shot right here, f***ing banger. Sora 2 totally changed the game, allowing us to create commercial grade client work without ever leaving our computers and never picking up a camera. Sora 2 is the most powerful imagination engine ever built. Howdy everybody, I'm Jake. And I'm Tannis. And together we started a video production company just over a year ago that has already become a six figure video production company right here in Texas. And the way we have done that is with our years of knowledge and experience and implementing the latest and greatest tools and technology to amplify our workflows. We got into this game because we love to create content. And now these tools let us unleash our imagination. In fact, we can even use it to generate videos that we can use to start the conversation with these businesses and land bigger clients. For instance, Sora 2 is a game changer in the video generation realm where now we can create mock ads and sequential edits with one prompt. In this video, we're gonna be going over how to get Sora 2, where to use it, and what are the best prompting formats to get the best results. Let's get into it. So you're probably wondering, where can you access Sora 2 now? And there's a few different places. The first one would be from the SOAR website itself. To access this, you do need an invite code and there's a couple different ways to get one. I'm sure you can find one on community forums or if you know someone who already has access, have them share the code with you and you'll be able to get in just like that. Once you do, you'll be here on the home screen and it's set up like its own social media account. So it's pretty cool. You get to create a profile and share your generations there. You have your notifications and a discover page as well. Down here at the bottom, this is where you'll be able to type in your prompt and utilize the cameo feature. This allows you to feature a character in your videos. There's a bunch of famous examples here and you can add them just by clicking and it puts the at right there. You can also program your own by providing information with a 3D scan of your face and you can even generate yourself in your videos. So that's pretty cool. And that's actually the only way that you can generate faces with SOAR 2 from our testing. They seem to be very restrictive with you generating people's likeness and human faces through other places that we'll show off here. So if you wanna generate people, this is the best way to do it right here. It currently lets you generate 10 to 15 second videos here in both portrait and landscape, which is pretty cool. And these generations are going absolutely viral online right now. This is a great opportunity if, to be able to create product videos or just viral videos to get traction for your clients. There's also an iOS app, so you can download this right on your phone and be able to generate videos. And I believe that it allows you to generate these faces because it does contain the watermark. And that's one of the cons about using it in this location, unless you have a Sword Pro account, which can be up to $200 a month subscription, you're going to have these watermarks in your videos and there are some ways to remove them and there's some ways to generate videos without these watermarks in them, which we'll show you. So for the pros and cons of generating here, the pro is this is probably the fastest way to get generations since it's directly from the server. You can use the cameo feature to generate famous people and even yourself in videos. You get 100 videos for free generating every single day, but the only con is all of your videos that you generate here are going to have a watermark. So that leads us to our next options of some other places where you can generate Sora 2 videos that don't have a watermark. All right, the first option, you've probably heard of this, Higgsfield.ai. It's a really popular video generation website where you can generate from all these different models. So what you wanna do is go over to the video section and create a video. And right away, you'll be able to choose Sora 2, Sora 2 Pro, and their proprietary Sora 2 Max and Sora 2 Pro Max models from the dropdown. The differences with these models is they generate a slightly higher fidelity image, so it's better for longer videos and it has upscaling built in. So it is, does cost a few more credits, but this could give you a better result. So these are options also here on Higgsfield. Another cool feature about Higgsfield is if you go up here to the Sora 2 Trends, it provides a bunch of these prompt templates for all kinds of cool trends. So you can scroll through the list here and there's a lot of really neat ideas. You could go with a streamer or POV, a street interview. So if you click any of these, like the street interview, it applies it there as a preset and you can describe the look that you're going for. And it's going to help you create a viral TikTok or YouTube shorts video. The pros of using Higgsfield is you get access to the max models, the proprietary, higher fidelity generations, and you also get access to their template library of all of these ideas. So the cons of using Higgsfield is the generation times take a little bit longer than generating them directly from the Sora website. And this is a subscription platform. You have to pay every month for credits that might expire if you don't use them. 
All right, so our next option for generating SOAR2 videos is not a subscription and doesn't put watermarks on your generation and it's directly inside Premiere Pro. It's called Chat Video Pro, an extension for Premiere Pro. And full disclosure, we've actually developed this software to speed up our own workflows for generating videos. So let's check it out. Right inside Premiere Pro, we can open up the Chat Video Pro extension and choose SOAR2 right here from the model dropdown. And this allows you to generate SOAR2 videos directly inside your timeline, just speeding up the whole workflow. There's even a custom video prompter here that allows you to talk to ChatGBT to make the best prompts for the videos. So the pros of generating videos with SOAR here is there's no watermark, no subscription, it's right in your workflow. The cons are you can't use people's faces. Unfortunately, the only way to generate is using the Cameo feature right from SOAR's website. So that's the only way currently you can actually use someone's face in a generation. All right, so now I'm gonna pass it over to Jake and he's gonna show you how to use SOAR2 in some real world examples and even how to use it to land bigger clients. All right, let me show you how to make commercial ready work with just one prompt with just your computer and no camera right inside Premiere Pro. I really love this Rambler water and I wanna send them a spec ad to potentially start working with them and maybe build a contract with them. So I'm gonna generate a full Rambler water commercial with one prompt with Sora 2 and let's see how it goes. Cool, so I really love this drink. I'm gonna go ahead and visit their website. See how they have selections, I like this one. I'm gonna go ahead and do right click Save image and Rambler, bring that into my project. This project folder template is clutch for staying organized. So I'm gonna bring it into the footage, download, Rambler. Awesome, now I have this source image and then I'll bring that into Chat Video Pro. Right here you see the interface. I'm going to click an attachment. So I'll bring it into the Chat Video Pro dialog box as a source image, now I'm gonna say, I want to create a 12 second commercial for Rambler Water, where it starts out showcasing the source from being limestone mineral blend from Austin, Texas. It's a sparkling water for Texans, by Texans from limestone mineral blend. All right, so I just gave it a random prompt and Chat Video Pro is backed by OpenAI's ChatGPT, so it's gonna analyze that, it's gonna give me a perfect prompt on how to prompt Sora 2. So I'm gonna copy this, paste it in, I'm going to attach my reference image so it knows exactly what the product looks like. Then I'm going to make sure I choose my video model. I'm gonna go ahead down here and choose Sora 2, just so I can make sure it's fast and as cheap as possible. You can do Sora 2 Pro, it's a little bit more expensive and it has higher quality, but I'm just gonna go with Sora 2, see what it does. And then I'm going to activate the video generation button. I'm going to choose the duration to be 12 seconds. And then vertical aspect ratio, nice, here we go. And then I'm gonna go ahead and send this off for Sora video generation. All right, here we go, let's see what the first generation did. Rambler water, refresh your spirit. All right, so that was the first result, but it's not the final result. Let's see if we can get something more dialed in and let's use timeline prompting. And our friend Rourke created this awesome custom GPT that allows you to get more dialed in responses. So I'm gonna tell it the exact same thing with this custom GPT. We're gonna link this custom GPT below so you can use it for yourself to create expert prompts for talking to Sora too. Let's create a commercial, 12 second commercial for a mineral water called Rambler. It's based out of Austin, Texas. It's sparkling water made with limestone mineral blends and it's just the most refreshing drink you can get. All right, so this prompting GPT is gonna help me make a timeline prompt that will make it to where it's much more sequential and understanding everything you need. So it's gonna ask me a couple of questions. Perfect, before I build this full cinematic timeline, just one quick creative check. Would you like the tone of Rambler commercial to feel more natural and outdoorsy? Texas rivers, limestone cliffs, sunshine, or more premium and sleek? Slow motion water shots, modern studio lighting. Let's see. I'd like to see a blend of the natural and outdoorsy Texas rivers and limestone cliffs with a lot of sunshine 
and then showcase slow motion water shots of the mineral water being poured into the can and make sure that this prompt includes that we're gonna attach a reference image for the Sora 2 to really utilize the reference image throughout the video. Starts out with the hook, the cam drone glide over Texas Hill Country, golden hour light reflects off a winding limestone river, nice. Sound effects, soft gurgle of water, faint cicadas in the background, emotion, calm, sun-kissed anticipation. The transition crossfade shimmer as sunlight hits the lens. Reference, use reference image to guide color tone and landscape composition. Awesome. This is already so much more dialed in than my preliminary just conversational style prompt to Sora 2. So this is an awesome tool. So now we have our final timeline prompt dialed in. Let me copy this. I'm going to bring it back into Premiere Pro. I'm going to paste it into chat video pros dialog box. I'm going to again attach this reference image and then I'm going to activate the video generation button. 12 seconds. All right, let's send it in with the timeline prompt and see the result. All right, so now we have the generation from the timeline prompt. Let's check it out. Born from Texas Limestone. All right, so that was pretty good for one prompt video generation. So I'm gonna download it. Bring it to the timeline. Sweet. So now I can go in here. That, that's a pretty cool drone shot of limestone, Texas limestone right there. Awesome. Limestone water. Sweet. And then pouring into the can. Nice. I mean, that's a pretty cool shot. I mean, that's like limestone water to pouring in. Boom. Honestly, I love that. And then I don't, I don't love that it, it like spilt over and then it did this. So I'll probably just go from here. Nice. And then skip this because I don't really like that. But then pick up right here. All right, so let's see the sequence. Starts out with a drone shot. Cool. Born from Texas Limestone. All right, so that was with Sora 2. Now let's do the same prompt with Sora 2 Pro and see what kind of generation we get. So I'm gonna go over here, change the Sora 2 Pro model. I'm gonna get the same prompt right here. Copy this, paste it in, attach my reference image and activate the video generation button. 12 seconds, yep, nine by 16, yep. All right, let's send it with Sora 2 Pro now. All right, so the Sora 2 Pro video generation is in. Let's check it out. Born from Texas Limestone. Oh, nice. So, video generation with AI. I don't like all of it, but I did like some of that. So I'm gonna download it, bring that back into my project. Sweet, so now I just took the best clips of all three generations, took selects and put them in their own sequence, and now it looks like a pretty pro-grade commercial. Commercial. Born from Texas Limestone. Nice, that's pretty awesome. Honestly, like this shot right here, I am very impressed with this shot. I really like this shot. Like that would be really hard to get the lighting and the environment like that, and then the shooting, like that would take a while to get that composure of that shot with that splash with the S and Q shot, like that slow motion right there. And then this composure right here with the golden, golden hour lighting, consistency with all the image right here. So now I have a sequence from a drone shot to splashing on limestone, pouring into the can, and it says born from Texas limestone. So we have a commercial client ready piece for this Rambler water brand. And that was in three prompts. Yeah, I wish it was in one prompt, but with AI video generation, it takes a few iterations to get it to where it's something usable. And of course, this is not the most epic thing I've ever created, but now I can send this as like a prospect lead generation. I could send this to Rambler and be like, hey, here's a free piece of content. If you want more, I can create a whole 30 day campaign. You can have one piece of content to publish on all your social media channels for the next 30 days. Let me know if you're interested. So I give them the sample piece and they're like, oh yeah, I would love to have 30 pieces of content going out on a regular basis. How much would that cost? And so then it can get you in the door just, and you can mass produce commercial grade client work without ever leaving our computers and never picking up a camera. This shot alone right here is something that is commercial grade. 
This looks imperceivable from something that would take a cinematic camera. Great lighting in the slow motion and the sound design. Born from Texas limestone. And now it's at a unique location on the water. I didn't have to trek out to find this unique location to get this sparkling water sitting on a rock within Texas limestone environments with the sprayed mist on the side of the can to make it really pop. Like this is a really good shot and it's a really good polished commercial client asset with one prompt. As creatives, AI video generation has not completely made us obsolete yet. It has amplified our powers and made us to where we can create something from nothing instantaneously. To be in this generation of video generation is like the golden era. We all get to create our imaginations in a much more rapid pace and we don't have to spend a lot of time or money or travel getting the shots we need. So there you have it. Sora 2 can help you create commercial assets for any client with one prompt. Thank you guys for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and comment what kind of tools you would like to see inside of Premiere Pro.